Hello everyone, uh, welcome to another video. Today we are going to talk to you about how to find your VIN number through your source code. Um, this is usually the page you would get to when you go to tesla.com slash tesla account. Uh, for me, I have a Model 3 at the moment that has a VIN, but um, obviously I replaced that with a fake VIN number. And same here with the Model Y. I actually have a reservation right now with white interiors. Um, I'm not going to get into the spec right now, but basically you go here and you click on manage and this is going to take a while to load and once it does get loaded, you're going to see a page. Um, you usually have different, it's going to look a little bit different for everyone depending on what step you're on. Um, but right now it seems like for Model Y reservation holders, you'll have to finish all the process, entering your registration info, um, the payment method, things like that. Okay, so once it loads, it's going to be like this page right here, um, except right here, usually you'll have your reservation number. And um, if you already have it been assigned to you, um, like through your um, delivery advisor or something like that, you might even have it been below this reservation number. Um, but usually once you do pick up your card, that reservation number gets replaced with your VIN number. Um, but right now I'm still holding on to my reservation. I still haven't gotten my vehicle yet because um, mine's a white interior and it seems like Tesla hasn't done many of them yet. Um, right now it's June 10th. Anyways, I'm blabbing on too much. Yeah, you will see reservation number here. Sometimes you might see a VIN number here, but it depends. Most of the time you don't. Um, immediately, the quickest way to figure it out is just to right click on one of the white spaces in the background or anywhere here is great as well. Usually most people's screen are going to look around something like this. Just click anywhere white is great and click on view pay source and this is going to open a new tab in your browser history and then from there it's going to take a while to load as well so let's do that okay so once you get here um usually you'll get a bunch of gibberish if you don't know what code is but what you want to do is do command f and type in f y j now right now you can see that i have a vin in here and that's because i'm trading in my model 3 uh, I'm going to basically block all of this out anyways, but right now there's one result for 5YJ as you guys can see right here. There's one result, but that is actually my trade-in vehicle, um, which is a Tesla, which is why 5YJ returns a result. If you're not trading in Tesla, you're most likely going to get zero results, but if you do have a VIN and you get a result there, that means that is your new VIN and your VIN has been assigned. Um, and from there, you can probably contact your local delivery um, store, so wherever you're picking your vehicle or your closest Tesla uh, store, and ask them and see what's going on and see what they can do and give you more info. Um, because usually there's not much info on the website, you'll have to call your delivery advisor or local store where they can access your registration number and get a better idea of what's going on with your vehicle. So this is pretty much how you um, figure out what your VIN number is through the source code. Um, online for now um, this is the quickest way to find out if your delivery advisor or tesla hasn't uh, responded or let you know what your venue is yet this is one of the quicker ways to find out sometimes you might not even get it and your, your delivery advisor might contact you first it, def it depends but this is how you get your source code thanks for watching and if you like this video or videos like this please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this